But a dungeon I am Lord Welshy, and I'm playing Five Nights at Freddy's 4. Um, I know what you're thinking, everyone's playing this, and you're right. Because I'm everyone. Let's start. <laughs> Five days until the part. What party? Hello, Golden Freddy. <laughs> Who's laughing? <laughs> what did he do this time? I don't know. He locked you in your room again. <laughs> Shut up, phone. Don't be scared, I'm here with... I don't want you here with me! I don't like this. These are my friends. Okay. I'm crying. I don't like... Jesus Christ, this is creepy already. Stop laughing! I'm just... Curl up on the floor and cry. He's obviously quite scared of the... I think they're toys. Tomorrow's the end of the day. Jump scare? Night one. Hello, little Freddy Teddy. Oh, it's a Freddy Teddy. Oh, it's so cute. Oh, click here to run to the door. Flick mouse downwards and run back. Closed doors hold shift. Oh, crap. Flashlight. Closed doors. Run back. Run to that door. Warning, listen carefully. If you hear breathing, hold the door shut. Well, I hear dogs. Okay, so this is an interesting... mechanic. Well, I played the first two. Uh, first three, even, Five Nights at Freddy's. And uh, never completed them, because I got too scared. And also rage quit. This is a very different experience, I have to say. What's really weird is I can sometimes hear Brinze closing doors in the house. Why does he have doors on either side of his room? Anyway. What the? You are a son of a bitch, you tiny little teddy thing. I think there's something in this house. Check behind me. God, I'm going to be so paranoid. <gasps> I fucking saw you, Bonnie! Jesus Christ. Oh, and it's only 4am, 5am. I need to be... I need to be taking my time and listening. So where's the next big bad? Or the first one, because that was a little bad over there. Oh my god, that was freaking chica dica fucking god. Bloody hell. Um. No! No, no, no! You get off the... Oh, thank fuck for that. Oh my goodness me. Wow. 
Um, I'm not even getting a chance to do any, like, real talking because I'm too busy listening for the breathing four days until the party. What party? You know he is hiding again. These are my friends. Yes, they are. Oh. You won't stop until you find him. What in the balls? It's the... It's just the noise. It's not even the... Hello, Foxy. Fun with plush trap. Hold control to use the flashlight. Use flashlight to stop plush trap on the X. To skip two hours on the next night. So it's a plush version of spring trap. Hence plush trap, clearly. So what must... So I'm guessing I've got to wait for him to... Will he make... Will he make noise when he comes off the chair? Because I've got to wait for him to come off the chair. Nope. Okay. Nope. Ooh, okay. I'm scared of Plush Trap. He's scary. My question is, can Plush Trap kill you? I don't want to test this. Yeah, you stay there. Nope. Too bad. Yeah, I know. Too bad. So sad. Oh, well. Never mind. Never mind. Night two. It's lovely calligraphy on that. Night two. Just keep my mind off the horrors lurking in the dark. Oh, hello, Chica. Shut up, phone! You're breaking the immersion and tension of the game. See... The doors are slightly open when he get to them, like on the left and right, but he's pushing them open when he gets there. Now is he pushing them open wider? <laughs> oh, Bonnie, you're a fucker. I don't... Oh. Oh. Uh, um, I'm going to have to try and clean up the peaking on the microphone because um, I'm guessing it's going to be super duper high. Much like my voice. <laughs> For God's sake! A chicken should not have that many teeth. This is much, much harder than the first three. Um, it's an incredibly different game mechanic. Because um, you're actually moving in this one. I mean, you're still in the same room, but you're you're not sat looking on a CCTV camera at, uh, trying to find the animatronics. You are just hoping to all goodness that they don't turn up at the door. But you actually, this is the thing is you have to actually go to the door and look. You know, you're actively moving towards the animatronics. Oh, hello, Bonnie. Hello, scary thing. Tiny Freddy. See, I can't hear the breathing. The crickets are too loud. <laughs> oh, I am not oh god damn it I am not going to beat night 2 sweet Jesus right well that was a very quick look at 5 Nights at Freddy's 4 um, sweet Jesus that is very very tough oh my god Bonnie 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 oh wow the animatronics have really ramped up um, true true nightmare fuel um, I don't know how far I'm going to get it in this one. Jesus. 
I think Scott Cawthon really has a thing for tormenting people. Like, if you look how far he's come since the first Five Nights at Freddy's, compare it to this one. I mean, I I love the first, second, and the third Five Nights at Freddy's. I mean, the first one was fantastic, really original. Two and three were very, very good. Kind of played on the same mechanics, but introducing refinements to it. But this is incredibly different. There's no cameras whatsoever. You're in that room. You're going to the doors. You're having to just purely use sound key, sort of sound cues. And considering I cannot hear them at all, but I'm getting there and checking within one or two seconds. I think you've got to leave it three or four seconds to try and hear them, because uh, obviously you've got the creak of the door. But oh, anyway, I'll come back to this at some point, um, possibly even tomorrow night, and we'll see how far we get. Anyway, thank you guys so much for watching this one. If you liked it, hit the like button down below. If you want to see more from me, click subscribe. If you want to hear me scream and flail some more, I will put a Five Nights at Freddy's playlist somewhere on screen. Maybe here. Maybe there. I'll figure it out. Um, but anyway, I will catch you guys in the next video. Bye-zies!